Hello, welcome back to Fallout 4. We are making our way to Diamond City today. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. <gasps> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. <sighs> you open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> I can wait all day, Danny. Open up. You. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but yeah. Shh. Lay along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> You hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to Crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. <sighs> Sounds good. Let's go. Great day in Diamond City. Piper! Alright, well, we made it in. I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. Always believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money. Settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? My son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant uh, Don't who's listen been taken? to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help. Here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Well, sure. And. A mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Well, uh, there's uh, one private citizen, Nick Valentine, a detective of sorts who specializes in tracking people down, usually for debts. Or no, uh, I have to get going. I'm sorry, Diamond City Security doesn't have time to help, but I'm sure Mr. Valentine charges a reasonable fee. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security... I've had enough of this, Piper. Families? From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours yeah, on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Right. I'm impressed. Not everyone can claw information out of McDonough's tight-fisted hands. Hmm. Why don't you stop by my office after you see Valentine? I think I just found my next story. Seems like they went for kind of a noir feel with this game with detectives and reporters and I don't know, it has an you're old school to, kind uh, of feel. Uh, Diamond City Radio, if, if you're listening at all. I guess Diamond City and Sanctuary would be this game's version of 
megaton and rivet city from fallout 3 but i kind of prefer those over this i guess fallout new vegas had good springs and of course new vegas but i don't know sanctuary and diamond city just feel like the weakest offering out of the three games But while we're here, we need to sell some things. We have way too much in our inventory, and even our companion can't carry any more equipment. <laughs> What's happening? Hey, kiddo. How are the paper sales? Well, the presses are getting overloaded. That motor is going to go soon if we don't replace it. Uh, you've been saying that for weeks and the old girl still keeps cranking. Stop worrying so much. I gotta head into the office. You start whistling if you see any angry politicians Why? coming our way. Is something way. wrong? Piper? <sighs> that looked a little glitchy. But we haven't crashed, so we're gonna keep, keep going and like find that. a merchant. I'm start thinking you're a simp. Did he just call us a simp? Uh, it's nighttime, so some of these stores are gonna be closed. Everyone else may be closed, but Diamond City Surplus is open 24 hours a day. Let's see what you have. Here you are. Well, I ain't kidding. I ain't gonna All right, well, I bought some ammo and sold some junk. I'll keep us a little lighter. Now we just gotta find Nick Valentine's office. Alright, not much to do in the market district at night because everything is going to be closed. Detective. Wait, did that say greenhouse? I saw the detective sign and went in. Oh, while we're here. As he wants it, so it will be. Harvest some fruit and then we'll find the actual detective office. Oh, it was right beside. I guess it was just an arrow pointing over here. His ties. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... He's gone missing. Don't worry, I can help. Tell me what happened. Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please hurry. All right, well, I think we're done here. We don't have much other business in Diamond City now that we've sold off our junk. 
So I think we're going to head over to Park Street Station and try and find Nick Valentine. Just want to check out where we're headed to. Okay, I think the quest is active. So it should show up on my map. So, um, <clears throat> this radio station here, we, we don't really make any caps. And, uh, there are, uh, well, some people help me stay in the air. People like, uh... Okay, that should point us in the right City direction. Surplus, now open 24 hours a day. Management reserves the right to refuse service to anyone. Especially since... Please. Hey, how about a song by, uh... The ink spots? Don't move, Synth. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a Synth. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family! Put the gun down, now! He's a Synth! He'll kill us all! Kyle, no! Okay, show's over. There are no Synths in Diamond City, hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. Well, thanks for the ammo and caps. Let's get out of Diamond City before we're next. Okay, I think we're close to where we're heading to. brought the dog. I'm pretty sure I could have went and got Piper instead, but that would have been an extra step and traveling with the dog is fun. It just seems appropriate wandering the wasteland with a dog by your side. I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. But that detective snooping around. Oh, Back me up. That gun ain't working so well. Not super accurate anyway. <laughs> Oh, are they shooting our dog? Sniper rifle might be a better call. Need something more accurate. Oh, the recoil on this thing is crazy. Okay, it works amazing with that. Lay that pistol down, baby. Lay that pistol down. Seems like there's still one of them in there, though. Lay that pistol down. Oh, drinking beer in a Was I having fun? Till one night she caught me right. Now I'm on the run. Oh, lay that pistol down. Lay that pistol down. Pistol back in mama. Lay that pistol down. Oh, I see you every night. Bing and I'll woo you every day. I'll be your regular mama. And I'll put that gun away. A, a sort of a note, I guess. Um from a sponsor here in Diamond City, and I'll, um, I'll, I'll, I'll just read it. A portion of this broadcast has been brought to you by the Mega Surgery Center. 
now featuring facial reconstructive surgery. Why settle for less than perfection? Bay Hutton is on now. Singing about a man, right? Ah, that's so stupid. It's Betty Hutton. That's not. <laughs> Well, they know we're here now. And it hangs around at a bar. If it acts just like a cross patch, a face with whiskers that scratch, if it stops, we're out of bullets for this. If it walks, if it talks. It's a minigun a bad idea. At least we have lots of ammo for it. a lot more guys in here than I was expecting. If it breaks and tries to make you think it's wonderful, be on the lookout. Don't let it fool you. But if it's kneeling down on one knee, saying, darling, please marry me, then don't hesitate. Name the date and then grab it. Hold it. Hang on to it. For it's a mess. Definitely a tougher area than we've been in so far. We're for sure gonna end up over encumbered with everything we're picking up here. At least once we get Nick, we'll have a choice of different companions to choose from. We can take our dog, we can take Piper, we can take Nick Valentine. Well, I can see me now in my Who's shooting at us? In the no one around. Well, we're healed up at least. Hopefully we're almost at the entrance of this vault. Kind of just taking the guns and ammo, some of the healing items, and anything valuable.
Alright, I think we cleared them. give him some of these guns so we don't get weighed down. So I know we're going to find more. Just trying to see what I don't need. I wish it told you the dogs carry weight. Can't tell if we've almost filled him up or if he can carry a lot more stuff. It's cool, it does the whole animation everything. So we're entering Vault 114. He just um, kicked my dog. Here in Diamond City, and I'll, um, I'll, I'll, I'll just read it. A portion of this broadcast has been brought to you by the Mega Surgery Center, now featuring facial reconstructive surgery. Why settle for less than perfection? Ray Smith is right behind you, baby. I mean, it's his song. He's not actually behind you. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to startle anyone. You should turn around because there might be someone behind you but it's not Ray Smith because he's singing so I got a question why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station this place is like the opposite of air. because they weren't planning to use it you moron Still looks like we're out in the subway. It looks the same. Wow, how many of these trigger men have we killed now? Oh, 
Yeah, these old gangsters fit the whole noir feel of Fallout 4. Think you know the score, huh? Each morning a missionary advertises me on sign. Where'd you go? He tells the native population that civilization is fine. And three educated savages holler from a bamboo tree. Is a thing for me to see. So bongo, 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 I don't wanna leave the Congo. Oh, no, 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 no. Bingo, bango, bongo, I'm so happy in the jungle, I refuse to go. Don't want no bright lights, false teeth, doorbells, landlords, I make it clear. That no matter how they coax him, yeah. I'll stay right here. Okay, now it's starting to look more like a vault. I look through a magazine the missionary's wife concealed. Magazine? What happens? I see how people who are civilized bung you with automobiles. You know, you can get hurt that way. At the movies, they have got to pay many coconuts to see. Alright, he's how named, you doing so I'm guessing we're after him. Feeling hungry? Want so Keep talking, meathead. Lock tight. Him alone, more time to think about how he's gonna bump you Don't off. Give me crap, Valentine. You know nothing. You got nothing. Really? I saw him writing your name down in that black book of his. What? Wow. Then he struck the name across three hey, times. You. I don't know who you are, but we got three minutes before they realize the muscles for brains ain't coming back. When they've got two weeks vacation, they hurry to vacation ground. What do they do, Daddy? Well, that was easy enough to open. No hacking required. Bingo. Question is, why does he come all this way? Fish hooks. I got my risk life and limbs. So no private eye. I'll stay right here. They have things like the autumn bomb. So I think I'll stay where I am. Civilization. I'll stay right here. My son, Sean, is missing. He was kidnapped, but I don't know who took him or where they went. Did, huh? Well, you came to the right man, if not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame, and she's got a mean. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Malone's crew here used to be small time, muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger players. So they found this place. Don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. Empty vault. Perfect hideout. I love the voice actor they gave him. And it's kind of cool they made him like robotic, like a synth.
Hey. Alright, we're escaping with Nick. Rescue mission completed. Look at that Commonwealth sky. Never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. How did you know where to find me anyway? Not many people knew where I went. Your secretary, Ellie, she sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. All right, well, I guess we're headed back to Diamond City. But we're going to do that in the next episode. So we're going to end it here. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.